on page 87 of our books and we're starting this question here so it's umbrella the umbrella below has an unusual design it is based on a regular octagon reproduce the diagram to the dimensions given okay so all our dimensions are given here and we've been told that it's based on a regular octagon so an octagon is an eight-sided shape so if we count them here one two three four five six seven eight so it's an a side shape and we know that it's regular so all the sides are the same and all the angles inside are the same as well so we're going to start by drawing a circle of a diameter 140 in the middle of our page and we're going to draw a horizontal line and a vertical line through it okay um, if we see this line here bisects straight through the center of the horizontal and the vertical line so that tells us that, that if that's straight through the center of a 90 degree angle it tells us that this angle here is actually at 45 degrees so we'll be using our 45 degrees that square then to bisect them two angles and then we'll be drawing our three different octagons okay so we have an octagon inside an octagon inside an octagon so three different octagons all with a different uh, radius so to start with We want to set up our sheet and I'm going to measure down 120 from the border and I'm going to draw a construction line across my page. Okay, so this is a light construction line and from the left hand side of the page then, I'm going to measure in 190. And a vertical construction line then as well. Okay, so this is going to represent the center point of my circle. Go back to my drawing here. And the radius of my circle is 70. And I'm going to take away 20 then, and I'm going to take away 20, and then I'm going to be left with 30. Okay, so back to my drawing. It's going to be 30 plus 20 plus 20. And I'm going to draw three circles then from our center point. First one, let's do that as one of the darker right? The second one, and the third one. Okay, so I have a circle of radius 30, of 50, and 70. <coughs> now, um, as I said, we have a line going across here and a line coming down here. So this is a vertical line, this is a horizontal line. Where they intersect, we have a 90 degree angle. So we have one, two, three, four 90 degree angles. And if we went back to our drawing, we'd see that there's a line bisecting straight through the middle. So if this is 90 degree, a line that bisects through it is 45 degrees. So we're going to get our 45 degree set square. bisect the center point and bisect these two lines as well. Okay, so these are all construction lines so far. And now it's just a matter of joining the few dots. So if I go to the very top point of my circle, start with the outside one. Move around to where this line intersects that. It's going to be this point. Move along until this line intersects the outside of the circle, which is this point. Carry on all around, just mark your points. And then I'm just joining them points up together.
head, so that's the outside of that. Done with a black pen. And I'll do the next one in a blue pen just to show you. So moving into the inside circle, so this was the radius 70 circle. Moving into the radius 50 circle. And just marking all the points where the line intersects the circle. Then finally, the inside circle, which is in radius 30, mark off all my points. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and 8, and then join all them points up together again. Okay, and that is how we draw our umbrella design.